protecting ourselves and first we'll blow it up and then we'll throw some stuff in um, so if you guys want to start if you want to put in a tablespoon of baking soda okay and this is really um, about experimenting so don't you know you don't have to measure you don't have to worry about it um, you, you just have to kind of dump it into the um, go ahead and dump it in the water and um, and we're going to kind of stir that up a little and you're actually right. making a solution here, which is interesting to kids because you see how it started out cloudy? Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. It's going to actually turn clear because the, um, the solid is dissolving to the liquid. So you can start explaining that sort of thing to your kids, and that's, that will amaze them. Like, where did it go, right? Mm -hmm. <laughs> right before and, then, your eyes. and then you can put, throw in your candy corn or candy hearts, whatever. And what's fun here is when you stir it, you can show the kids kind of the context of a vortex because that's exactly what happens when you Going stir something and and just like you're in your toilet you can show them that as well <laughs> <laughs> so anyway and then um, we'll throw in some raisins but you can see all this stuff is solid and it, it's not buoyant it doesn't float it sinks mm -hmm. to right the bottom to the right bottom. so what happens when you add the vinegar just go ahead and pour some vinegar in oh, there okay yes ma'am how much do we want just i don't know as much as you want that do the trick i smell that why don't you that's add some sure. more, more Make some more foamies. More vinegar. There you go. Oh, okay. yeah. There go. Oh, yeah. And uh, so <laughs> obviously, that's every kid loves that. And then, this is why then, you have your pan, <laughs> Daddy. Daddy. Yeah. 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 That's yeah. why we covered the table, too. So, um, right. So that thing will just continue to and go. And there they go. There's the raisins. They, they'll go up and down and oh, up and down. It take long enough no, for them to fizz up. And the more, so the more, um, the more gas you create by creating more of a reaction, so the more you know, the acid you put in with the vinegar, base you put in with the baking soda, the more of a reaction you're going to get, the more the more bubbles, the more it's going to work. There you go. And you can actually do this in a, um, in a, a, a thing of, of just soda too. It'll, you'll get the same effect, but use a clear soda so you can actually see it happening. Yeah. But soda's full of CO2 gas. That's what makes it fizzy. Fizzy. Remember that 